What's good YouTube and welcome back to the channel. JD here with yet another video for you guys. The sneakers I'm gonna be talking about in this video I've actually been trying to cop for a few years now and they are a pair of Vans old schools. Chicago based retailer Notra has done plenty of collabs with Vans in the past on some really nice colorways of the Vans old school. And this time around the colorway inspiration actually came from cafes. And I actually managed to cop two of the colorways in this pack. I will be reviewing the Vans and Notra collab in the Espresso as well as the matcha colorway. What is up guys welcome back to all of my long-term viewers shout out to you guys man thank you for still messing with me and if this is your first time here my name is josh i do sneaker reviews all kinds of other sneaker content come for the sneakers stay for the chill vibes make sure you hit that subscribe button it really does help me out and also make sure you give me a follow on tiktok as well as instagram i'm pretty active on there as well so in this video i'll be breaking down both of these really nice colorways of the notra and vans collab we'll get into the quality of the sneaker how these fit what these are going for right now on the resale market and of course as always i will be giving you guys that on feet look in both of these colorways so make sure you guys stick around for the end of this video so here it is the vans old school collab with notra i've been seeing pictures of these shoes and previous collabs on pages like hidden new york for like the last two years and i've always just wanted to grab myself a pair 2022 i did say i will be moving away from you know just copying hype stuff like nikes and jordans and trying to cop different brands and so far this year i've copped solomon's asics vapes and now we got some vans too and i believe the official name of this pack is the best served together pack these sneakers did drop as part of a three pack the third pair that is missing was this blue colorway which was inspired inspired by Japanese tea sets. But you guys know me, I love the earth tone, so I definitely just wanted to cop the brown and green pair. Let me know down in the comments which of the three was your favorite colorway. The sneakers do come with different boxes, the brown box, and I also have a green box here. It does have some Notra branding on the side of the box. You see the Notra handshake logo as well, and when you open up the box, you have this phrase, there are many ways of doing things besides your own. And this is actually a phrase that's been taken from from a magazine from the 1960s called the Whole Earth Catalog. Notra has said in the past that they have taken a lot of their inspiration for their shop from this magazine. Moving on to the shoes, let's get into the Espresso colorway first of all, which is actually my favorite out of the three. Very much love this chocolate brown colorway on the upper. When you look closely, there's actually a very subtle difference in the tones of the brown on the different panels, the different suede panels of the shoe. And then on the medial side of the sneaker you see this canvas material also done in that lighter brown very nice quality on the suede too it just feels very soft it's not like a new balance level quality of suede however it is very very nice you do get different lace options here and i have two of them right here the white as well as the chocolate brown or espresso brown colorway and you also get a third lacing option here this is a lighter brown which matches the medial side let me know guys down in the comments which of these laces look best on the shoe I think with Van sneaker, you gotta go with the contrasting white. That just makes the shoe pop the most. You get that patented nice white chunky midsole as well on this pair. The sneaker is technically not a Vans old school. It is a Vans OG style 36, which does look very much like the old schools. However, it does have a slightly longer tongue. And moving on to this very clean pair of the matcha colorway. Here, the panels are done in a much more visible contrasting color. You do get that lighter green on the midfoot and a darker almost like a minty green on the toe box as well as the back panel and once again you get different laces the white as well as this minty green and once again a third lacing option this time a lighter green these are also super clean luckily i got both so i don't have to decide of course the most distinct feature about the shoe and what really makes it a notra collab is the replacement of that normal van stripe with the handshake logo of notra which has been stitched into the shoe and i gotta say it just looks so clean this is the definition of a very well executed collab you know now i can't tell anymore whether i like these better or the espressos these weren't that difficult to cop actually Actually, they're released on the Notra website. It was a normal Shopify release and they use that H CAPTCHA type of release. So you basically got to draw a square around an object. 
These are definitely the best types of releases. They don't really get botted. And just a tip for you guys, if you normally struggle with that type of capture, my tip is on the first attempt, draw the square as closely as possible around the edges of the object. And then before you click OK, just make like one slight adjustment to it. Like just move it up and down a little bit and then press OK. And this method works for me pretty much every time. So it's not about trying to get it done as fast as possible. You gotta be a little accurate and then do that little bit of extra so that they know that you're not a bot. I've noticed on the IG feed that there's been quite a big resurgence in Vans lately, which is great because I think Vans is pretty much the most anti-hype sneaker there is right now. And it just feels like right now, people's preferences are kind of changing a little bit and moving away from just copying hype stuff. There really isn't a more versatile shoe out there. This pair goes with literally everything. If you guys wanna see like a how to style Vans video, let me know down in the comments. I wouldn't mind doing that. For sizing purposes, I got these in my true size, which is a US 11, and they fit me absolutely perfectly. Some people say they like to go half a size down in Vans. I say whatever you normally wear in Vans, you can rock it in the Notro as well. If you've never worn Vans before, I suggest going true to size. Looking at prices right now, now these are the prices currently showing in StockX Germany, which is probably a lot higher than the prices in StockX US. This sneaker only did release on the Notro website, and to get it over to Germany, I I actually ended up paying about $150 total per pair, which was basically the shipping and then the customs as well. So when you take that into account, these prices aren't actually too bad. They're not much more than what you would have paid anywhere copying retail from this website. Because of how limited this release was, I actually think these prices are probably gonna go up quite a bit as we get into the summertime. So while they're at their low prices right now, I would suggest copying them. Overall, the Vans Best Surf Together Pack, I definitely think these are an absolute cop. I love the colorways, love the quality of this shoe, and I'm definitely gonna be getting a lot of use out of them. It's also one of those subtle flex type of shoes, which I love. It's like, you know, I can see you guys are rocking the Vans, but you don't have these. Let me know down in the comments, what do you guys think about the Notre Vans collab? Have you always been rocking Vans, or is this your first pair? Let me know, the on feed about to drop right now. Don't forget once again to hit that subscribe button. It really does help me out. And I will see you guys next time. Peace.